and good evening, my dear ladies and gentlemen. As always, my name is Light Liger, and today I'm gonna be doing a review on this multi coin wallet called Coin98, which is available as a Chrome extension, which this review will be based on. Alternatively, you can also get it on your mobile devices on iOS and Android. So, as I said, this is a multi coin wallet, which actually supports quite many different EVM based chains, including Ethereum, Polygon, Binance. Smart Chain, Huobi's Eco Chain, and others. So here is the extension, and here you can basically see all the assets that are being supported. Alternatively, once you have logged in here, you can click the wallet tab also in the Coin 98's website to basically get access uh, to your portfolio and what coins basically you own. So what are the coins being supported? So let's start from the top. So we got Ethereum, Binance Smart Chain, and by the way. Uh, all tokens for these coins are being supported on the wallet as well. Uh, Solana, Tron, uh, Tomo Chain, Kusama, and Polkadot, they don't have token support yet. Uh, Avalanche's C and X Chain, Cosmos is here, Tar Chain, which is not actually on uh, any of the wallets that I'm using outside from Trust Wallet, I think. Band Chain, Terra, Persistence, which is part of Cosmos, Kava, Near. Phantom, Polygon, XDI Chain, Cardia Chain, and Ronin. So a lot of different options to go here for in terms of coins that are being supported. And as I already said, all the coins uh, tokens are being supported as well. And here you can see kind of like the full list. Um, there's also one for Bitcoin. I'm not sure is that going to be supported in the future or something, but it's right now not there. And then there's also Cello, which is not also part of the current list. So these are, I guess, up and coming coins that they're going to be adding in. There's a lot of very, very cool stuff built in also into the wallet, such as uh, token issuer. So I can create a token uh, through this interface. And I don't think it's going to be costing me anything except uh, gas fees. And I will be doing a full video on Binance Smart Chain uh, token creation in, this, in the future. But... You can put your symbols, logos, token mint, token burn, on owner address, a lot of cool stuff here. So this is a very neat trick that, by the way, no wallet absolutely has. No wallet I've used actually has. Also, it has uh, inbuilt uh, cross-exchange. So if I obviously have an Ethereum here linked up, okay, we got to, you know, clear up the uh, CAPTCHA here. So basically, this has uh, inbuilt systems for most of the actual chains and the popular DEXs that reside in them. So I don't need to go into the specific website. I can basically access Uniswap or any other exchange through the Coin98 application and do the swap that way. Obviously, some people are preferring to go through those interfaces, but this interface can be also quite convenient for you as it allows you to easily swap the GUI, which is kind of dumped down in the modern versions of MetaMask, for example. So uh, another very, very nice feature, also slippage altering here as well. So a lot of different things. There's also a non-pro version which just hides features basically. And there's also a daylight mode, but I kind of prefer the night mode here. Also, when you actually app the, uh, open the extension, you can click manage and I can add custom tokens. I can also add more wallets in. So basically by clicking the bus plus button on the top, I can, you know, okay, there's a token that is not showing up or I'm just having token that I want to add. I had to paste the smart contract here and it would automatically will basically create that token into your wallet and you can basically view it here alongside with your other assets. So that is also a very, very convenient way. There's obviously a send button here as well as well um, and receive also history tab for all the transactions that have gone through. Uh, this specific set of, um, you know, coins that you hold. There is also when you go back into, let's go back into the wallet page here. Um, there's, um, there's a swapping mechanism also that you can um, leverage. So where is it actually? Products, token, multi-send also for certain assets is available. So I can send, you know, if I want to do an airdrop, or I want to send payments to an employees. Um, the multi send app is obviously a very, very convenient way to just issue multiple transactions 
uh, at a one go. There's obviously a limited amount of chains that actually support this uh, multi set thing, but it's it's there. And there's also the cross chain token swap, which I was just talking about. It took me a while to basically find it out. Hopefully, we don't have to go through another captcha here. But so basically, it is a very convenient wallet. I don't know what features are on the mobile or are they the very same. But there's like, you know, gas fee tracking here also built in. There is passwords, um, custom tokens. We already touched upon that. There's the manage tab we are also looked into. And here is once again, the longitude of all these uh, assets that are being supported. And they also say what assets are here. So ERC20s, SPL tokens, BEP20 tokens, Ethereum supports also ERC NFTs. I don't know how you can basically view those NFTs basically on this uh, chain. So that's uh, another question, but that's something you can basically do. You can restore your existing wallets by their monomic phrase. So maybe you were already using an Ethereum wallet uh, in the past, but you want to just swip in, you can just do the monomic phrase in here and basically start using the Coin98 uh, version, which might be more fluid and faster for you. But that's kind of my, my, my short rundown of, of this uh, platform, inbuilt DEXs, token creation, uh, token support, supported chains, and they actually have a uh, yield farming going on on PancakeSwap by staking Pancake. Uh, you can get uh, Coin98 tokens. I don't know their actual utility, uh, but um, definitely something to look into perhaps in the ecosystem page. Let's take a quick look into here. What does it actually have in store? It's on actually quite many exchanges already. So FTX is big and Binance. So uh, has staking, governance. So I guess you can have a vote on what type of a chains are going to be added in the future to the actual wallet. And that's, that's big. Uh, that's a great way to have integration on many different things. And the token is alive on SPL. BEP20 and ERC20 formats as of right now. But that's pretty much my rundown of this wallet. Obviously, I have a full playlist of these multi-coin wallets, and I definitely recommend you to take a look at them to find the best one for you. One thing I would obviously wish from the company to have an actual desktop wallet version, which would allow me to do a bit more uh, different things and access it just not by opening my browser. Thanks for watching. I will be seeing you guys on the next video, whenever it will be.